It is so good. So yeah, no worries. Don't try this. So this should only take. That is one of your cookies on it. Hey guys, welcome to another vlog. Chad and I are going to bake some Christmas cookies for Santa Claus. <laughs> you ever bake any cookies before? I used to bake it. Do you? Yeah, what kind of cookies? Christmas cake, vanilla cake. So your mother used to bake. Did you make it from scratch? You no. never bake in a cake. Yeah. Make it from scratch. We have everything we need. We got the pan to mix all the ingredients. We got the cake mix. It's a Betty Crocker cookie cake mix. Yeah. Chocolate chip cookies. We got one stick of butter. We only need one egg for this video, so hopefully it's true. I got the foil paper, I got a non-stick spray. I know it would be nice to use, there's a certain type of sheet that people use to bake things on that's non-stick and really nice, but there isn't any and I couldn't find any at any of the supermarkets. But we also have the baking sheet. And this reason why I'm putting the foil paper over it because it's kind of old. <laughs> And then we have this little, um, what do I call this? Strain yeah, yeah. Strain, yeah. So just because I want the ingredients to be nice, but depending on how the chocolate chip is inside, we might not use it. And then we have, um, like I said, this non-stick spray is so, so, so nice. I'm going to use that on the tray. All right. So it's a heat oven. Okay, so I need to preheat the oven. Since I'm using an aluminum pan, I'm gonna preheat the oven to 375 degrees. So let me do that right now. Okay, the stir cookie mix, softened butter and egg in a medium bowl until dough forms. All right, so the cookie mix we got in the bowl. We need to get another container. So I'm gonna have Chad um, crack the egg. So I'm gonna crack the egg in, in this container. And then I'll peel off the butter. Alright guys, so um, we need to soften up the butter a bit, try to crack the, the egg. I'm going to grab a little bowl and a fork. How did we meet? Like, who? Through our mothers. Through our mothers. <laughs> Through our mothers. <laughs> so I don't know if this is the right way to do it, but I'm going to try to um, soften up the butter by Pressing it down, the oven is still preheating. Yeah, why um press it down? Yeah, yeah. No, the fork can get in between it better. See? Let me show you guys. When I first met Chad, he was quiet. I don't know. He was cute. But me nobody too like like Chad. Yes, you were kinda quiet, you know, but you didn't have this like a way about you where you just a laugh and a giddy giddy with everybody. But you're still be quiet like even you know, like yeah. one time we were well he was delivering some barrels um to my grandparents house and i went down with him and doing and doing and i were like having a whole conversation and oh, chad just in you know, the car and quiet no. you know and talk me i look at me i say all right so i guess the boy and i have no opinion from nothing not the topic you guys are talking about yeah 
But I'm not even try, you never even try jumping in. The boy just. Are you the one that like, obviously? No, yeah, yeah, yeah admit. This is what the butter um, is looking like. I think I'm doing a good job. So, what I'm doing is I'm just pressing it down, softening it up. Um, and I really, too, too like using a microwave or like that in a butt. Might even just shove it in the microwave for like a 15 seconds. Especially now that it soft up and mush up like this, it should melt pretty quickly. And on top of that, the oven just finished preheating. So honestly, we need to hurry up. So let me, you know, I'm plugging the oven a microwave. All right, so I'm gonna plug in the microwave. Mega, we up the egg. Honestly, I don't even think we should be doing all this extra stuff. Mr. Stephen, Chad is my chef's assistant. So, if you guys see me do doing a lot of the work, Chad is here for his pretty looks. I'm the chef, Chef B. So, honestly, number two says stir cookie, mix softened butter and egg in a medium bowl until dough forms. All right. So, I'm gonna put this in the microwave. I think 15 is good. Let's see. I get all the mix up the joint. Let me do all the other work. I didn't get to mention it to you guys before, but I also got some Snickers. I don't know, just to top off the cookie with, because I think it might, might give it a little touch. Even though the chocolate chips in here is really, really big. That was right. We need a little bit more time. Alright guys, so. The butter is a lot more soft and runny. I need to wipe that up, but let's, um, yeah, pour it in here. Ooh. I don't know if you guys remember my last video, but it never, you know, the cookie them never come out. Oh, them be supposed to come out. Some in here. Some more. Man, you see the king out by myself, you know. Mm -hmm. Guys, right, let me see, cause this this look, this look right. crumbly. Shut it. It's a dough. Soft and butter. We put all the butter in there. Guys, tell me what we're doing wrong, because this is so crumbly. We can't release this, right? <laughs> I'm going to put it up. You see, that's why people, you know, people freddy freddy when they make the content. You guys know I keep it authentic. So keep mix it until dough forms. So the dough form now. I don't think the spoon dough is... Because the fork, they are crush the cookie that's why I'm start use it. Oh, okay. So I thought that's why you put the dough Ah, sometimes yeah. you just need a woman's touch, you know. Yes, if you add one more egg. No, I have to follow the instructions. But the cookie them beat out, so I'm really, really glad I got the Snickers because some of the cookie them are beat out. But it is turning to dough. I just yeah, don't good. think um the spoon is the best. Spoon. Yo, all the cookie, the, the um, chocolate chip are beat out. <laughs> we tried. Either way, it's all about the, the taste, not the image, the, the personality <laughs> of the cookie and not how the cookie look. So I think it look pretty decent. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it look like yeah, dough. Hmm? But if you're going to mix it, it still, it still will crush them. And plus, Jamaica Hatina, guys. The cookie done melt already. So this is what it's looking like. Cut up the Snickers. The Snickers is actually melting a lot. Ooh. 
cut up the Snickers. Just going to chop them. Chop them. Chop them. It's actually a milk olive. Don't chad. That is one of your cookie gone, you know. All right, let's chop it again. Chop it again. Chop it again. Chop it again. So we have a bunch of these little pieces. What I think I'm gonna do is plop them on the cookie. Yeah, I think that would be like, I don't know. Hmm? No, we we are baking them with it on it. Yeah, but I'm not gonna mix it in because then it might get crushed and mashed out like the chocolate chips. So, like I said, what I'm gonna do is, when we're done set out the cookie them, we're going to drop the chocolate, like drop the Snickers on top of the cookie. You know how they run? Should I pour a little? Mix, pour a little. Mix. That's what I did, you fling out the butter. Are you? No, Are we you? can rewatch the video and Are you threw the butter in there, Chad. Who threw the butter in there? Who tell me to do it? Who threw? I did not tell you to do it like that, even when I took up the egg. And you guys, guys, the video like guys, let me turn this on the dull side. Press it down. I think someone had told me not to use the spray one time, you know. But that's all. We're not going to use as much as I did last time. I'm going to rub it in. Just so it's not as thick. Yes. And plus it's supposed to be non-stick, so hopefully it helps. No. The package had said something about um, using a spoon two and a half inches apart. Oh, it's an un ungreased cooking sheet. We'll just flip it over and pretend. <laughs> pretend we never greased it. <laughs> okay, how about this? Let's. Okay, so oh my god. Is it on this one? Here's my hand. Turn it into a ball. How about that guys? We might not be able to do as much. I think this is what I learned. But these are big. I have to teach Chadina guys. Cause that was my mistake last time is that I put so many on the sheet. You want a roll one? Grab them about the same size. So I think this one is a little bit too big. But this is our special cookie. Yeah, perfect. Someone said to put the rest of the cookie dough in the fridge or like the freezer. Damn. So yeah so it doesn't dry out and that uh, by the time you're ready for the next batch so this should only take 12 to 14 minutes so we can do a couple different batches see cute right all right guys the oven is ready Let's put the cookies in the oven. Thank you. Let's put it down. And what time is it on your phone? Alrighty guys, it is time to take the cookies out the oven. Let me show you the time. It is five o'clock. Five o'clock, right? Right? So let's get these out. What I'm gonna do is later tonight, I'm gonna bake the rest of them. Cause I really, really 
want you guys to see the magic of what's going on with these cookies. Oh, they just look so pretty. Oh my God, I'm so proud. This batch look much better than the first batch. And these mittens are definitely perfect. Guys, always practice safety when you're taking things out of the oven and putting things in the oven. It's probably still a bit too warm, but cookies are perfect when they're warm. Mm. We're yes, gonna I did. Yes, I did a good job. I have a good job. We. We did a good job. No, but I'm both in service. You can't see that so good. Yeah, okay. No. Let me come and show you guys what it's looking like close up. But I need another bag. <laughs> this is what it's looking like. I remember we put the Snickers in it. It is so good. 10 out of 10, would recommend. Actually, I would sell it. This is so nice. Mm. So, I give the cookie, um, may I give the cookie a 10 out of 10? Yeah. 10 out of 10. Now, I'm gonna finish off by saying one, two things that I actually can't live without. The love of my family and Chad. Your turn. Well, the most common thing nowadays, Wi-Fi. You hear the answer when we give, right? Your precious girlfriend and mm -hmm. family. Yeah. yeah. It's true, because when you go into somebody's house, the first thing I ask for is, what's the Wi-Fi? <laughs> put them, put them yeah. All right, I'm gonna keep eating this. I'm gonna put on a Christmas movie and I'm gonna drink some milk, my almond milk, <laughs> because Santa, Santa's not getting none of these cookies. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And if you enjoyed this video, stay tuned for more. Let's see what the rest of Vlogmas has to offer. Yeah, yeah.